Hi, I'm Zoe Hall, and I'm here to share why I'm inspired by the life stories of Frankie Muse Freeman, Wayman F. Smith, and Mary Jackson. Frankie Muse Freeman was a civil rights attorney and a prominent activist. Freeman received her law degree from Howard University Law School in 1947. Freeman's work as a lead lawyer on a landmark case for the NAACP was revolutionary, as it ended legal race discrimination in public housing in St. Louis City. Freeman later was appointed as the first Black woman on the United States Commission of Civil Rights in 1964. A mentee of Frankie Meese Friedman, Wayman S. Smith, also attended Howard University Law School. Wayman S. Smith was a notable civil rights activist and attorney in the St. Louis area. From marching on Washington with Dr. King and helping Black citizens in the South register to vote, Smith switched from being on the front lines to practice civil and civil rights litigation right here in the Gateway to the West. As an executive at Anheuser-Busch, Smith opened many opportunities for Black professionals in the surrounding area. While Mary Jackson didn't attend the real HU like Smith or Friedman, the Hampton University alumni's contributions are deserving of recognition nonetheless. Mary Jackson was a mathematician and an aerospace engineer at NASA. As NASA's first black female engineer, Jackson worked directly with the space capsule heat team to ensure the model was stable for takeoff. As a fellow black woman entering STEM, learning about Mary Jackson's story encouraged me to give her thanks for her trailblazing and inspired me to keep forth on my journey as to pursue a degree in computer science and later a PhD in data science. But the life stories of Frankie Muse Freeman and Wayman Smith do just the same, as all the individuals have faced hardship from external forces that conveyed the idea that they were not worthy enough being in particular spaces due to their race. But Freeman, Smith, and Jackson didn't listen to these voices and still enact and spark change using their race as a form of advancement, not as an anchor. And I intend to do just the same. Thank you.